Hey, in this uh, video we're going to be talking about FTP. And an FTP is basically uh, something that connects to your server that makes it so you can upload files and stuff from your um, computer here. So I can like take this folder and like put it where I want to in my in my server. Um, but basically I use uh, Transmit and that is an Apple one you can get at the the Apple iMac store um, right here it was like I think it was like thirty five dollars um, but you can get free ones um, there's one that's called FileZilla that you can get and it's free and then you just basically connect it to your server so that you can upload big files to to your website and it makes it so much so much nicer um, but basically we'll go into Media Temple or whatever your hosting service may be, um, and you click on your main account in Media Template. That's what you do. You basically then you go into the control panel here, and then you just click Server Guide, and there it should show all of the information you need to input um, for your FTP, like this stuff right here: the FTP dot domain name dot com username, you know, and the password. Um, and it may it's super awesome with this. Um, I'll usually upload all my like web themes and stuff through here because my themes are big, so I'll just upload it um, through here, and I'll show you what it looks like. So this is the beginning right here. So I just click my domains. I'll click on WordPress Trinity Essential since this is the website we're on right now. And it gives me my files. Don't let this scare you. It looks scarier than it really is. All you really know, need to know is the WP content. And then you click that, click themes, and then here are my themes right here. So basically, I'll just go to my web templates here. I'll go to WordPress templates. And then I can upload anyone I want. And then you get these files right here. All these files. Oops, you highlight them and then you drag and drop right there. And they should automatically upload to your FTP. And then it'll show up on the back end of WordPress.